Hello everyone. I hope you all are fine. Today I am going to show you a tutorial in which we are gonna configure our NMIO on Wi-Fi. In the previous tutorial, I have shown you how to get started with NMIO, and we have seen we have connected uh, our NMIO, our USB to our laptop, and then we have controlled the LEDs, four LEDs on the MIO. The gyroscope on Mario and the single push button on Mario. We have controlled all these things via USB. But today we are gonna see how to configure our NI Mario on Wi Fi and then control all these things via Wi Fi instead of USB. The link to this tutorial is given in the description of this video, and uh, on this link you will see uh, manually how to configure your uh, NI Mario on Wi-Fi. Uh, if you have a project on Mario, then it's my recommendation to use Wi-Fi instead of USB for uploading and testing of your code. Because uh, Wi-Fi is very flexible and you have you are no more restricted to USB cable. Uh, I was working on a project in which I have to control a code and uh, it was very difficult for me to upload the code, first I have to connect my Mario with laptop via USB and then have to upload the code, then I have to remove my USB and then test this code on the robot. So that was quite difficult with USB. But uh, with Wi-Fi, when I switch, uh, switched my uh, Mario on Wi-Fi, then I can simply uh, write my code and then upload the code via Wi-Fi to Mario and then test it on my robot. So, using Wi-Fi, your task becomes quite easy and you can easily test and upload your code on Mario. So, <clears throat> as given in this video, uh, in this tutorial, first of all, what you need to do is, you need to connect your 12 volt battery, 12 uh, volt charger with uh, NI Mario, which I am just plugging in. So, now I have connected my 12 volt uh, uh, charger with NI Mario. Now I am going to connect my USB with Mario and other side of USB with my laptop and as soon as you connect it, you will get a small box which is shown here. Now uh, you can configure your NI Mario using this third button but when I click it, you will see what happens. Here is my IP address of NI Mario and it says 100% opening but it just I don't know why but it doesn't open and you will see uh, it will show a lot of files to download and uh, I just have to close all these windows close all windows so I was unable to open this uh, uh, Mario on Microsoft uh, on Mozilla Firefox so what I did I tried other browser so what I did is I simply copied it and then I opened Firefox sorry uh, Internet Explorer and here are some ads on my Internet Explorer ignore them so you, when I enter it here and you will see a new link uh, page will open up so somehow it's just working on my Internet Explorer. It's not working on Mozilla, it's not working on Chrome or Safari. It just worked on Internet Explorer. And the reason I found is, which I just uh, exposed is, that uh, this page required Microsoft Silverlight to work. And Microsoft Silverlight is designed by Microsoft and uh, this Internet Explorer is also designed by Microsoft. So that's why it's opening only on this browser and is not opening on any other browser. Anyways, that's another thing. Now, once you open this page, next thing you need to do is you need to click on this network configuration button. When you click here, it will open up a new page. And because I have already configured it, that's why it's showing here. Otherwise, when you click on this link, it will show you something like this in fact like this Ethernet 
adopter USB 0 is the USB port which I have connected and it has assigned it uh, an IP address which is shown here 172.22.112 which I just given it here and this page opened up and then I click network configuration but my task is to configure my NI Mario over Wi-Fi so in wireless adopter WLAN 0 what I need to do is first of all you need to select uh, your country which in my case is Pakistan and you don't need to connect here you, if you disable it then this box will be disabled so you have to connect to wireless network so first of all select your country which is Pakistan next you need to select your uh, which I didn't remove so I am removing it here so you need to select your, wi uh, your Wi-Fi wireless network which in my case is Pakistan again and you have to give your password your network's password here which is hello hello which is not a secret so I am just showing you guys it's hello hello ok so uh, I have connected to wireless network Pakistan and then I have given my Wi-Fi password which is hello hello and now I am saving this setting and when you save this setting it will say refreshing connecting to Pakistan and uh, it will now assign some IP and here's my new IP address of my device now when you enter this IP address about so now you can see again the same page will open up and in the network setting you will see the ethernet is also connected which is actually USB port and it's giving the IP address here and the uh, Wi-Fi is also connected and it's giving the IP address here. Now, if I disconnect my USB, I am disconnecting my USB. Okay, I have disconnected my USB, and uh, it should change, which is not changing. So I have to refresh it again. I am entering the IP address of my Wi-Fi, not my USB. So now when I come here, and you can see because I have removed my USB. So that's why in Ethernet adopter section it says 0000 because I have removed my USB. Now I can simply upload my code over Wi Fi, which I am going to show you in the next tutorial. So for now, that's all. Here we got the IP address of our Wi Fi connected NI Mario. And uh, you can read the details of this tutorial here as well. Because I have shown step by step how to do it, and uh, that's all. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel and also subscribe to our blog by entering your email address here. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. Till then, take care. Bye bye.